All right. Are labeling my yoses or my yoses? Revita, do revita be All right. Good. Now, my yoses is different from my toses. What pull up? Come, come, tricky. We, we can go, come, tricky. Go, great ten. We really my toses. My toses no start like a cell. For example, I don't tell you how somatic cell are in the forty-six chromosomes. Ne, in the uh, genetic information X. At the end of mitosis, so draw end up aga two cells signaling the same genetic genetic material and nearly 46 chromosomes. The same amount of chromosomes, see, they the same amount there, they the same type of DNA. Yeah? However, meiosis is different. Purpose here may meiosis global and create who create the uh, cells that are in the link. The link have the number of chromosomes to divide the haploid. Already born as soon. And then, the purpose is to create a genetic variance. Genetic variance again. Okay. Genetic difference between the, uh, the cells. Are you, are you end up with the same genes? Ne? The same chromosomes? Ne? Good. Are 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 two men then? Early well, come more exam guidelines that Zarif. Remember, get the paper two, get only one mark, say, get by a get by a type. Ne? Son to revise in, son to revise in, you reach only about my two says, or revise the structures as cell, especially nucleus. We do nuclear envelope booking or nuclear membrane again because it will dissolve like a white from my two says. And then a central zoom, we do a and then cytoplasm again. Then, level level, level level structures are the chromosome. Ne? Level level structures are chrom a chromosome. Re 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 uh, what is a replicated uh, chromosome and what is an unreplicated chromosome? And then chromosome is the look at the look at DNA first. Ne? The thread-like chromatin network. Ne? And then it it, it, it coils around the proteins. Ne? Uh -huh. That is your chromosomes. And then each and every human being. On the 46 chromosomes, come guy, come on, the somatic cells. It's a hard. I somatic cells. You must know the somatic cells. The somatic cells are all of your body cells. All of your body cells. So, the division the somatic cells. King, the body cells are hard. Basically, all the cells in your body, except for sperm cell or the ovum, ovum king. Is the uh, gametia yamasat and then a spermaki gametia moon? Then we need to know what are haploid cells. So, for example, to give you an idea what are haploid cells, if your somatic cells, not if your somatic cells contain 46 chromosomes, yeah? and at the end of meiosis one, we draw one, you're going to end up with two cells each containing 23 chromosomes, 23 chromosomes each. So, haploid half, it has half the number of chromosomes. Zooms, ne? And then a diploid cell gaining a full complement of those chromosomes, that is 46 chromosomes. Ne? Good. And then you must know the sperm and ovum. Ne? The egg, the ovum. The ovum, they are called gametes. All the other cells in your body are called somatic cells. Ne? And then the close the shabaling, the close shabaling the sex chromosomes. The sex chromosomes are rather rather gonosomes. Get I'll, I'll explain just now. Get it. And then the autosomes. Let's get into it. Now this is just to show you that meiosis is a process a long or a continuous meaning I I am but I divide it into meiosis one and two. I saw the shabab breaky after meiosis one. It's a it's a it's a breaking and a very it's an over meiosis two which is the second division. No. It's a lapel, I am in the mood. The wire wire. So, one of the things that you must learn before I go cool, it give it you who gets so. Okay, King, one of the things that you must learn is karyotype. This is a new word for boy. Karyotype, okay. Karyotype, okay. Representation, okay. Representation, okay. Any number, a shape, and arrangement of the full set of the chromosomes in your. Somatic cell. Agree each and every person camera somatic cell I only 46 chromosomes. Those 46 chromosomes exist in pairs. Ne? And they, we arrange them according to 
first of all shape yeah you see they have a sh similar shape these ones yeah? then we then refer the number yeah? take number one shape is working number one shape is working number two and then how they are arranged that's what we call a karyotype so basically how chromosomes in a somatic cells are arranged according to their shape size uh, number that is your karyotype then karyotype still on karyotype uh, consists of the following autosomes yeah? Autosomes again. Autosomes again. All these chromosomes, all of them, all of them except for the 23rd pair. Ne? The 23rd, 23rd pair. Now, pair A with 23 again. Get the gonosomes. Gonosomes again. Gonosomes again. Your sex chromosome. Did you tell me now? Okay, Masadi, okay, money. Ne? Cherry, orangey. Ne? Agro with the Wahopola single of the guy XX chromosome or Dirang, Dira. A female, Dira Musaki, ne? and then XY, Dira, Dira, G. So basically, kids are going to determine sex here, your mood, the chromosomes. Repeat and the gono, so the chromosomes that are responsible for determining the sex of an individual. The autosomes, any other chromosomes in a somatic cell uh, that code for other things. For example, it can be eye color. Ne? I color your house, shape your nose, of shape of nose, your height, skin tone, and so forth. That's a karyotype. Then the whole process here meiosis. Etoma guy. Etoma go interface. Ebe yako meiosis one, ebe yako meiosis two. During interface, just like uh, in, in, in my process as well. A chromosome chromosomes must divide ne? when they divide or uh, duplicate themselves ne? that is DNA replication ne? good most of the time the represented chromosome will be at, ne? will have a single chromosome this is an unreplicated chromosome that's a male chromosome and then the female chromosome a female chromosome Dito exist similar to how we saw them on in a karyotype. They exist in pairs. What do we call these pairs of chromosomes? Ewane tlako mama, ewane tlako papa. Revita di homologous chromosomes. Ne? These homologous chromosomes will code for uh, the same thing. For example, if the pair, let's look at pair number one. Ne? This is homo homologous pair number one. Ne? They are going to code for the same things. Let's say, for example, at some point they code for eye card. Ne? Your mom has the green eye color and your father has the blue eye color. Your, ma your mother's eye color is, domi is dominant over your father's eye color. So they're going to code for the same thing. Whether which one is expressed is, is determined by which one is dominant. So that's how we group them. So these are called homologous chromosome, or chromosomes. Each one from your mother, one from your father, and they are in a pair. During interface, homologous chromosomes are either. Homologous chromosomes, they, they replicate, making a copy. Or one from your mother, on a little bit, but they are the same thing. Then from your, uh, from, uh, from, from your mother, and then from your father. Yeah. Same thing happens. Now, after the replicate, hey, this one, I can count the number of chromosomes. I can count the number of chromosomes that we have in a cell. Reverikisa, the central mere, which is the central structure that holds the chromosomes together. Central Mere. How many chromosomes cell A? One, two. How many chromosomes here? One, two as well. Why? Because of the counter to count the number of chromosomes, the counter the number of central mirrors. But because it's a replicated chromosome, in Ali, what we call chromatids. These are one, two, three, and four chromatids. So one might ask, why does I we see a chromatid a one? Uh, on in cell A, in, uh, and then in cell B, repeat the chromatids. Uh, it can only be called a chromatid once it replicates. Ne? So these are two chromatids, ne? both belonging to your uh, to, to your father. These are two chromatids, both belonging to your mother. Ne? So the chromatids. Can I never the sister chromatids? I don't know the sister chromatids. So I don't know. Kita bata kahalese. 
So this is still a diploid cell. During meiosis one, the homologous pest cell, remember the homologous pest only. They close splita and they go into different cells. Okay? And then if the cell becomes haploid. Now, how many chromosomes do you see in each cell? Remember, in interface, there were one, two cell uh, chromosomes. Now, during meios after meiosis one, we have one chromosome in each cell, but they contain two chromatids in each cell. And then after meiosis two, those chromatids will be split, still creating haploid cells. Now we'll have one chromosome in each of the four cells that are genetically different. Ne? Good. Now, now that we've got that, are terming meiosis. Ne? So meiosis, itomagai. Meiosis is divided into two parts, meiosis one and meiosis two. Ne? Now, Ronaldo focus on guy. We are going to be focusing on meiosis one, starting with interface, with that replication. Interface. Remember, during interface, a cell is growing, performing its normal function, and the main thing it does is a performer, a performer DNA replication. It a copy a DNA then. Yeah? Good. For the sake of this video, I'm going to use the following. Here, one. Remember, it's, it's, it, they're still having condensed to form proper, proper chromosomes that look like butterflies. So, do one. Yeah? One chromosome, and then Arnale Ewoshi. Remember? And then another one, and then its homologous partner, Ash. Yeah? Now, during interface, they are going to make copies of themselves. This is DNA replication. This one, it's a copy. Remember the journey like I'm? The journey like a central, central. Yeah. And then Li, the homologous one, it's a, it's a copy. This is in interface. Yeah. Now we have replicated chromosomes. Ligamo, that's why. It's a copy. Is a copy a sheet. How many chromosomes? Another chromosome that I are are about this into me is around. Or now this into me one, into me two, into me three, and into me four. So there are more than four chromosomes. But how many chromatids do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight chromatids. But four chromosomes. So can you hear a language? Can you hear a language? Interface. After interface, ne, those chromosomes go now the now the cell goes into prophase one of meiosis. Ne? During prophase one, karata prophase, karata is divided into uh, early prophase and late prophase. During early prophase, ne? during early prophase, we are not. After mega di 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 DNA is they are condensed again. They become thicker and shorter. Ashidil. Here one ela replicate. And then Kemuela Yabubedi replicate. Remember, one is from your mother, one is from papa, one is from mama. Let's say Ashidil. These ones are slightly taller. Kiri homologous pair. And then Emweshi. Remember, this is a homologous logos pair of chromosomes. And this also is a homologous pair of chromosomes. Still, we have what? We have four chromosomes in total. Okay? The mother, your Father, Papa, Mama, Papa. Ne? They exist in pairs. Ne? Good. Now, what happens? Everything else is we eat. Central, the central zone ne? splits into centrioles 
and they start moving for the opposite pole. Yeah? So A is moving to this, this side, the A is moving to, the, to this side. The creator, the creator is spindle fibers. Yeah? And then what else will happen? The nuclear membrane. Nuclear membrane air shift a level. Nuclear membrane I agree during this time. Nuclear membrane air shift. This is during early pro phase. Ne? Good. Now, after this all happens, ne? now during late pro phase, ne? we rahala. We rahala what we call a process here crossing over. Crossing over a blind event. Crossing over. Ne? Are chromosomes are not bad. Ne? Chromosomes are not shitty. But it are the tails. Are the tails. The ela. Mm -hmm. And then. This, and then the homologous pair. And then the second homologous pair. And then. Ashi. Aha. Ne? Now. The homologous pair. During crossing over. The homologous pairs that are in they are gonna be uh, basically the homologous, homologous chromosomes they're gonna be next to each other ne? forming what we call a b valent crossing over crossing over the go once crossing over uh, after the, the form of bivalent crossing over yeah it's a halab. How does crossing over take place? Agarinale this chromosome, ne? and then inale a chromatid. Then the two inner chromatids, that each homologous pair, they are overlap. They are namela, Then the two inner, I'm just gonna draw it way bigger. The two inner ones, they are overlap. Now, when they overlap, ne, the former, more the overlap and more, the co exchange of DNA material, these overlappings, the divisor, the chi, ya, sma. Ne, and if it's a pedi, if it's a pedi, the chi, ya, sma, the divisor, the chi, ya, sma, chaki, plural, ya, de. Ne, so, where the two inner chromatids overlap, ne, they are called chi, ya, sma. Degree exchanger. Degree exchanger DNA. At the end of crossing over, regionally, that the homologous, the two homologous pairs. But here's how they are different this time. Ela ya papa. Ya mama enale chromosome ya papa. And a chromosome ya papa enale a bit of chromosome ya mama. So the exchange. Similarly, the second homologous pair. It will dissolve the day. It will dissolve the day. She. But in a link, in a chromosome from the other homologous partner. And then, similarly, similarly, we create a labial on the other side. So, the exchange is the exchange is DNA. Now, the whole process now, this leads to a genetic variance. The genes are mixed up. What about the scars? That's how you are born unique with your own genes. Because why? Because of crossing over during prophase. Why? This is during late prophase. After late prophase, it's Late profit. <laughs>